Good morning. Good morning, sir. Can you hear me, everyone? Good morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Sir. Good morning. And uh, <clears throat> very well done, Ziva Bita. Well done. Very good. Send correction. I can't attend class today because I have a headache. Yes. That's the most correct way of saying that. By the way, oh. my problem with Azul's sentence was very simple. He said, I am not attending. That was my problem, you know. I am not attend is not correct English. Because attend is a verb. And which form? V1 form. You don't use B verb and V1. I'll, I'll try and it together. You cannot write in a um, In English, you cannot write B verb and after that any V1. It's not possible. You cannot do this, okay? In English, B verb plus V1 is not possible. B verb plus V2 is not possible. B verb plus V5 is not possible. The only thing that is possible is B verb. Yes, please. B verb plus V4 and V3. Okay, let's understand. Uh, we say I go to school. Go is V1. Go is V1. I like tomatoes. Like is V1. I teach English. Teach is V1. So in all these sentences, did we use B verb? Did we use B verb? No. We didn't. I teach English, you learn English in all these sentences. My brother watches TV. My brother watches TV, watches V5, okay? My daughter loves chicken, V5. Yesterday, we went to the cinema. So we do not use B verb plus V2. That's never possible, okay? This is never possible. We can only say B verb with V4 and V3. <clears throat> now, whatever form of B, whatever form of B we use, like B ka koi bhi form use kare. Present form, past form, doesn't matter. Koi bhi form use kare hum, B verb ke. Okay? We will use V4 and V3 after that. We can never use V1, V2, V5. A B verb ke kuch forms jaan de. We know the forms of B verb. Present forms are is, am, are. Ye present forms hai. Pre past forms are was and were. So, in ke baad aap kabhi nahi bol sakte kya? V1. Kabhi nahi bol sakte kya? V2. Kabhi nahi bol sakte kya? V5. Never. You can never say this. It will always be wrong. Ab dekho, the problem is, aap jab likhte ho, to aapka aadat, bachpan ka aadat hai, you know, ki aapko B1 laga dhani ka aadat hai. Jaysi I bola, M bol dhani ka aadat hai. क्योंकि बचपन है आई एम आई एम आई एम एक साथ सीख जाते हैं ना तो कुछ सोचते नहीं है आई एम सीख जाते हैं आई एम ओके बट यू हैव टू बी केयरफुल तो यू कैन नॉट से आई एम अटेंड आई एम नॉट अटेंड यू कैन नॉट से दैट बिकॉज़ आई एम अटेंड अटेंड v1 है कैसे पता अटेंड v1 है अटेंड का v2 क्या होता है अटेंडेड आई एन जी अटेंडिंग v5 अटेंड्स v5 तो v1 है अटेंड वी कांट यूज आई एम अटेंड नॉट पॉसिबल Negative, I'm not at him, not possible. I hope everybody benefited from this small trick.
with B verb, only two forms are possible, V3 and V4. Let's talk about it. I am going. I am teaching. Hum padha rahe. B verb hai na? Past maybe. I was going. I was teaching. Yeah. Or you think V3. I am tired. Tired ED laga hai na? Kaun sa form hai? V3 hai. M ke baad hai na V3? I am tired. In this sentence, however, tired is an adjective. Hai ye adjective in sentence mein. V3 hai. But it is functioning as an adjective. I am tired. But it is possible to use V3 after B. So there are five forms of a verb. V1, V2, V3, V4, V5. And after B verb, only two are possible. V3 and V4. The rest of the forms are never possible. You can never, never, never. I'm using the word never. You can never use B1, B2, and B5 after B verb. Simple rule. So when you're writing in English, benefit from this. Okay. While speaking, you make mistakes. That's natural. But you will learn. When you're writing, you have extra time. Think about it. Okay. Think about this rule when you're writing. And never make this silly mistake. Okay, let's go back. Today's lesson is very useful. We are, uh, and interesting as well, we are talking about two people, uh, their childhood actually. Um, what are the names of the two people, guys? What are the names of the two people whose childhood we are going to talk about today? No, no, no. No, 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 no. You're not sure. I sent the homework yesterday. Come on, everybody. Tell me, which two people are we going to talk about today? Pete, uh, Olivia. Olivia and Pete, Pete. Olivia. Pete and Olivia. We are going to talk about Pete and Olivia and their childhood. When I was a child, when I was a child. Listen to Pete and Olivia talking about their childhood. Listen to Pete and Olivia talking about their childhood. Okay. And complete the chart. Have you already completed the chart here? What have you written here? If you have not done your homework, I'm not interested in checking. Okay? Sometimes it happens that the students ignore the homework. They don't do their homework. So if you have not done your homework, I'm not going to talk about it because after you listen, after you do the exercises, after you practice, you grow. My checking doesn't do anything, honestly. Okay? What helps you grow is your listening, you're doing the exercises, when you do the exercises, sometimes you get confused a little bit here and there. There I can help. But if you have not done your homework, if you have not listened to the audio, you have not done these exercises, if you have not thought about what is right, what is not right, why this is right, why this is not right, then I'm not going to check today because there is no point. Tell me, have you done the homework or you haven't? Those who have done their homework say, I have done my homework. I have Those done, have the done the work. Hmm. Simran has done their done her homework. Okay. Anybody oh, yeah. else? Hmm. Okay. So you listen. Tell me here. What should you write here? Here, here, here. Take a look. Very good. Very nice. This sentence. Not with Pete London. Pete and what London? In London. Very good. Very good. So other people, uh, let me be a little strict with Faizan. Faizan, have you done your homework? 
No, sir. Yeah. Jonas, sir. No. Faizan, are you not pushing me a little too far? Too much? You said that, sir, I cannot do the evening class. I'm busy. What about this class? You are free sir, only to actually... be present in the class. No, 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 no excuses. Don't, don't give me any reason. Because this is not the first day today, I'm telling you. Faizan, you're lying to yourself. You're lying to yourself if you are giving me any excuses right now. I'm telling you, you decided not to take the challenge. You're running away from the challenge, Faizan. No, sir. I told you yes, uh, I, I um, quit uh, evening class because I don't have time. And I have what job and... Uh, and my sister wedding in February and I start the uh, shopping. I go to market and I came late. First of all, I'm going to office and I come uh, back home and I go with my sister uh, to shop shopping. And if then you, I can. At came... least you should do your minimum. At least you should do your minimum. The minimum is the exercises, the you know listening. Sir, These only are... I can, I can, I can, uh, I can do only uh, listening uh, the audio file, sir. I do. While you're, I did. While you're listening, it doesn't take much to write. You can do it at night at ten or eleven as well if you want to. The choice, it's about you deciding your priority. Like I always say, don't yes. tell me you can't. You are right. I know how much time it takes. Yes, sir, you are right. You're taking it a bit lightly here. You think that you can handle it without doing those things. You are going to improve without doing those things. Of course you will. But it will be very slow, slow improvement, Paisa. If you want fast improvement, please change your attitude towards this class a little bit. Okay. Okay, sir. And Shazia, beta, be here every day. Shazia, is it you or is it Lalla? Shazia, is it you or is it your brother Lalla or Afreen? Who is here? Super Azar. Okay, Lalla. Shazia, beta. Please, please ask your sister Afreen to be here as well, okay? Um, because this class is important for you guys. Very important for you guys. Mehran, don't be regular. Shadab, don't be regular, okay? Uh, so, I, I don't think you guys are ready for this exercise. So, maybe we will check it to, on Monday. You guys can do it uh, today. Uh, tomorrow, and we will check it later. Let's talk about the next exercise in the main room. We are not ready to do this. Let's go to reading and speaking section, a talented family. A talented family. Do you have any talented people in your family? Do you have any talented people in your family? What can they do? Silent, right? तो शायद आपको याद नहीं कि आपको yes I do no I don't बोलना था यहाँ पे minimum कम से कम कम से कम क्या बोलना था yes, yes I do no I don't because this is the question do you have any talented people in your family all of you my dear online students when no, I say do you have I any talented have. people in your अब 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 बोलने का नहीं अभी भी गलत बोल रहे हो और अब बोलने का नहीं था मैं बोल रहा हूँ कि आप लोग आदत डालनी होगी आप समझते नहीं है कि आप कहां गलती करते हैं आपको लगता है आप आप बोल के दोबारा नो आई डोंट हैव बोल करके आपने करेक्शन कर लिया नो आपको दिमाग आदत डालनी होगी व्हेन समबडी इज आस्किंग यू अ क्वेश्चन साइलेंस इज नॉट एन आंसर आइदर यस और नो डू यू हैव एनी टैलेंटेड पीपल इन योर फैमिली तो इसके आंसर में कोई आदमी 5 मिनट बोल सकता है ओके 
लेकिन जो कुछ नहीं बोल सकता वो कम से कम दो वर्ड तो बोल सकता है यस और नो तो यस आई डू नो आई डोंट सो डोंट कीप को आई डियर स्टूडेंट एटलीस्ट यू हैव लर्न दिस ना डू यू हैव एनी टैलेंटेड पीपल इन योर फैमिली Again, all of you are quiet. I know. Ah, uh, I don't think so. Hmm. Does it count as a talent that I started going to school uh, at the age of two and a half? Hmm. Keep going, beta. If you want to add something more. Hmm. Not like that, but uh, my sister started making uh, chapatis and rotis when she was eight, and uh, mm -hmm. my brother has no talent, so I don't know. Hmm. And I don't know much about my family members, so I can't say really what their talent or their talent is not. Are they? I can't say if they are talented, beta. I can't say. Yeah. I can't they say if they talented. are talented or not. Repeat. Ah, uh, which line, sir? Last line. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Um, I can't say uh, if they were talented or not. Okay. If you are using the past tense, if you are talking about the past time, agar otherwise, if you are saying, "Mujhe nahi pata un log ke pas talent hai ki nahi." मुझे नहीं पता उनके पास टैलेंट था कि नहीं ओके दैट विल डिटरमिन योर आर और आई एम यूजिंग द फर्स्ट वन आई डोंट नो इफ दे आर टैलेंटेड ओके आई डोंट नो इफ दे आर टैलेंटेड और नॉट गुड अ डू यू हैव वेरी टैलेंटेड पीपल इन योर फैमिली व्हाट कैन दे डू वेल Uh, yes in my family i have some talented people my mom she can sing well and uh, she can also do mimicry she is very good at it but she doesn't do it when you ask her to do it she only does it while she is in a conversation and she will suddenly mimic one of our relatives but if you ask her to re repeat that thing she will never do it she is too shy she's got a singing voice she can sing but when she sings religious things she on purpose sings in a bad uh, way i don't know why when she hums or you know croons any movie song i notice how you know rhythmic her voice is how much in rhythm she sings but when she sings bhajans and all then she changes her voice in a bad way i don't know why she sings in a very monotonous way monotonous 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 monotone single tone a singer sings in different tones right but yeah up and down in the voice but my mom when she sings bhajan she sings in a very monotonous way but i think she's talented you know because she can sing she has the sing she has a singing voice and uh, <laughs> i can draw a little bit yeah if you give me a pencil and give me a photo i can draw a bit i can uh, maybe i'm out of practice nowadays so i'm not very confident but when i was young i could draw people's faces with a pencil i drew um film stars actresses you know and i drew calendars as well but only with a pencil i could not use paint i was not good with the paint brush hmm and my brother you know when he was young he wrote poetry and his poetry was very beautiful actually i i don't think he writes anymore 
you know, in life, you have too many challenges and you have to give up on your hobbies. So somehow, he doesn't write anymore. My sister, I don't know about her talent. I think she, it's not her talent, but it's her personality. She's very balanced, my sister, you know. Hmm. She knows how to deal with people. She's very social. Very social. And uh, yeah, her husband, he's a very good singer. He can sing very well. And uh, my daughter, sister's daughter dances very well. She dances at school and functions. But she's very shy. She doesn't want to go in front of anybody. She doesn't like meeting people at all. Okay, I talked about my family. Your turn. Um, I'll give you a couple of minutes. You guys talk to each other and talk about your family members. If they have any talent, you know, what they can do and stuff like that. Are we ready, guys? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. All right, let's go and talk to our family. To, to About our family, actually. Hmm. Practice, if you want. Go ahead, practice together. I am sorry, sir. I am not feeling well. Excuse me? I am not feeling well, sir. Don't fret. Pushy. Yes, sir. Okay. Join the breakout room, though. Be there. Listen to your friends talking. Okay, sir. Shut up. Thank you. 
No, that's not called talent. That's not called talent. Talent is something that is different. Working is not talent. Being a farmer is not a talent. Anybody can be a farmer. Uh, you know, like singing is talent, dancing is talent, acting is talent, mimicry is talent, drawing is talent, painting is talent. You know, Somebody can swim fast. That is talent. Swimming is not a talent, but swimming fast is definitely a talent. Huh? Yeah. Uh, you know, running is not a talent, but running fast, like Usain Bolt, the fastest runner in the world, definitely is talented. That's why he finishes 100 meters in 8-9 seconds. Other people will take 15 seconds, 10 seconds, 12 seconds, then he does it in 8 seconds. So he's talented. Sachin Tendulkar is talented. Boys playing in the street are not talented. All right. Now, do you have any information about your partners, family? Sir, we want more time. Jo whatever you know, share with me. No, we just had one one side conversation. Okay. From that one-sided conversation, what can be shared here in the class? Okay. So, Padma, uh, elder sister knows how to... Sorry, I forgot. One just a second, sir. Okay, yeah. So Padma, uh, older sister knows. Um, she has uh, a lot of confidence. She knows how to communicate with people in social life, and also she knows how to speak the foreign language, which is English or an official language of our country. And her second sister knows how to draw the pictures, and uh, she knows singing and. Uh, and all and her cousin sister knows how she is a she is a talent in crockery works mandy designs and her another cousin sister knows how to dance she danced very well and she is not a shy person she is also a very sociable person and for padma herself she doesn't describe herself much more so i don't know about that And other people, please. Do you have any information about your partners that yes, you can sir. share with Rupsar me? Rupsar is with um, father-in-law. Uh, is uh, uh, very talented. He can communicate very well to another people. He is very social. And uh, uh, Rupsar. Um, 
mother in law is also uh, very talented she can uh, take care of uh, all the family members and uh, ruksar um, father um, uh, my dear dan i am going to be very critical of every mistake you make now, from now on okay uh like when you are a child for four year old baby three year old baby and you uh do this in your bed at night you wet your bed the parents don't get angry okay they understand that kids do it right but when you are 10 years old and you do it then parents slap you they shout at you they insult you why because now it is not the right time to do it so faizan i am going to feel make you feel bad and i'm warning you already okay faizan i'm going to make you feel bad for your mistakes up to you now how you handle this ruksar mother what is ruksar mother faizan ruksar's mother sir so who would say that what you were waiting for me to correct you no sir i also say that okay recording you will listen to the recording then this means that you in your new mind you didn't notice you couldn't hear yourself you were saying ruksar or ruksars you have the recording sir, actually uh, if you say that uh, i think sir uh, uh, if i don't uh, if uh, i don't have uh, i i don't have any idea how what i say then uh, it's a, it is uh, mistake sir but i know sir when i said said about uh, her family then uh, uh, i put uh, uh, spot uh, um, uh, s sir apostrophe s yeah apostrophe s right well uh, again i will say there is recording and you will watch the recording tomorrow to find out whether you said s or not okay because i noticed that and i have already told you every silly mistake you make when ruksar makes those mistakes when khushi makes those mistakes i'm going to kind of ignore okay i'll say oh ruksi not that way ruksar not this way but with you faizan i'm going to be rather critical why because, because i quit uh, i quit uh, uh, evening class no 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 that's wrong that's very very wrong no because i believe that you are not doing your best and you, okay. now it, the onus is on you faizan to prove me wrong when a student is trying his best and is still struggling then as a teacher it is my job my duty to support that student but when somebody is taking it easy taking it too easy then it is my job to tell them that you need to do better okay yes hmm. all right let's carry on quitting the evening class uh, if i have felt bad about it faizan then i would say maybe i was wrong there but um, i had this feeling i could be wrong faizan but i had this feeling that that class was challenging you know you had to work harder to understand what i was saying there what i was teaching there isn't that true faizan actually sir this um, i don't have uh, much time at evening and uh, uh, some students uh, are uh, only talk and talk and uh, that's your are... problem i knew faizan i knew that's your problem faizan you become a little bit judgmental suddenly you now don't trust my decisions and my abilities now you override your decisions uh, my decisions okay you think because some students talk more that's why i should leave that class let no, me tell sir. you faizan uh, it yeah, is yeah it yeah is i've, I've a, observed by that reason because i've observed uh, you negativity for shahid afridi that shahid afridi talks a lot then there are some other students who talk a lot i agree with you sometimes no, sir. they over uh, but uh, i want to i i also want to talk but uh, at that time i am in the office and so i don't saying, have so you are saying when i become capable then i will come to this class and i no, will sir, talk right no sir because 
I I want to say, sir, when I I am in uh, the class, but I don't have attend uh, uh, conversation, and I don't uh, 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 I don't have time to uh, uh, participate in conversation. Uh, then, sir, how, what watch yesterday's I do? recording. Watch yesterday's recording. There is there are two students in the class. They never talk. Tofik, have you ever heard him talk? Tofik, have you mm. ever heard him talk? Mm. No, never. He never speaks in the class. Okay. There is another guy. His name is Saurav. He rarely speaks in the class. Both of these guys are very quiet. And let me tell you. Those two are the best students of the class. I believe that I could be wrong about, it means other students could be wrong, but these two will get the answer right every time. And when you talk to them in private, one-on-one, -on -one, they will impress you so much with their English. Everybody has their personality. Some people are quiet by nature. Some people are talkative by nature. Okay? But learning doesn't depend on these things. You can be a very introverted student and you can be a very good student. You can learn a lot by keeping quiet. And it is possible that you speak a lot. There was this woman, Hina, in your class, Faizan. She was so talkative in the evening class, remember? Oh, no, you don't. Hina. Who remembers no, Hina? Padma, you remember Hina? Padma? Yes, sir. She learned very little. She talked a lot, but she learned very little. So don't tell me that people who speak more, learn more, people who keep quiet, don't get the opportunity. It's not like that. These are ideas in your head. The only thing, suppose this is a class of 20 students. Imagine if it was a class of 200 students. They could learn if they believed in what I believe. What is that? Listening to the teacher. Paying attention to the teacher's words. That is what shapes their learning okay guys remember how much time you occupy speaking will not determine your speaking or your ability to speak how focused you are when you're listening to me how attentive you are when you're listening to me that is going to you know improve your speaking skills so i know faizan and i told you that you have now started taking your judgment more seriously than my judgment. And uh, I know how you felt you complain about it, that these students keep speaking. So when you allow such things to enter your mind once, it's very difficult to get rid of those thoughts, Faizan. Um, I can only say that people uh, listen to you when you speak. And in this class, you do the same what they do in that class. In this class, you speak the most. So this, how how should other people feel about this, Faizan? Should they but say sir, that, okay, I don't talk uh, continuously, uh, 10 again, minutes, again, 15 minutes. Again, again, I am present there and I'm not doing anything about it. So you should still trust my decision. But I know you are judgmental now and that's the problem, okay? I have, I no, sir, actually, I, I, I have I, been teaching already... for nearly 20 years. I have met students like you as well, okay? There is nothing wrong with you. The only problem with you is suddenly you have started allowing negativity to take over. That's my uh, conclusion. Okay, Faizan, there is nothing wrong with you. Just try no, sir, to actually, get rid of that negativity. I want to participate those this type of class. I don't want to take uh, silently, and I want to no, 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 participate. No, 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 Faizan, stop, mm. stop right there. What you want doesn't matter. What yes. you want doesn't matter. Let me tell you why. If you say, I want to participate in a class, that's not compulsory for learning. That is not really essential for learning. If participation, I'm, I encourage people to participate. Why? Because I want to make sure there are students like Sabah, when they keep quiet, I know they're not getting things right. So I want them to speak so that I know where they are go getting wrong and I can correct them. But those students who give me the confidence like Saurav, like Taufik, I normally do not push them much because initially I was a little nervous about them. But they showed me that they are quiet type of people, but it doesn't mean that they learn less. They learn the same. 
Okay. Here, notice Khushi doesn't speak much. So learning doesn't depend on your speaking. Please clear, have it very clearly in your mind. Your learning. Sir, you get depend, wrong, sir. Your sir. learning depends on my speaking. Okay. So as long as I'm speaking to you and you're listening to me, you're doing fine. They speak where it is necessary. However, some people are talkative, and I agree. Some people, especially you, if you're talking about Shahid Afridi, yeah, he sometimes does it. But then that is how the class becomes fun. He doesn't do it every single day, once a week, once He's a ten very days. good person, sir. <laughs> uh, we are sir, not here uh, to give... I was saying that I was job there. Can, can, to... can, you, can you keep it in English, Faizan? Can you keep it in English? You don't no, have to sir, speak to English. No, sir, because you get me wrong. That's why I don't uh, uh, say anything in English right now. I am not getting you wrong, Faizan. First yes, of sir. All, you have that you getting 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 me wrong, sir. Because I want to say uh, anything in English, but my English is not very well. That's why you uh, not uh, my understand. English is not very well. My English is not very well. Correct me. My sentence. my my English uh, isn't uh, good. Yes, there is a difference between good and well. Okay. So when you say my English is not good, that's fine. But you don't say my English is not very well. You say, I don't speak English very well. Very okay? well. I don't speak English very well. But my English is not very good. Okay. Okay. I allow you to speak Hindi, Faizan. Go ahead. Speak. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Sir, actually, in the time, I'm in office. I'm in the data entry. I'm in the office. 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 या तो मैं क्लास पे ध्यान दूं पहला दो चीज हुआ पहला अब क्या है सर कि जब मैं काम से फ्री रहता हूं जिस दिन उस दिन आपने देखा होगा शाम वाले क्लास में मेरे को कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता है कोई जितना भी बोले मैं पूरा अटेंड करता हूं मेरे को उसमें इंटरेस्टिंग भी लगता है बट काम भी कर रहा हूं और आपकी आपका जो इंग्लिश है सर वो मेरे लिए फायदे वाली चीज है लेकिन जो भी हमारे जैसे स्टूडेंट है उनका इंग्लिश कहीं पे सही सेंटेंस होता है कहीं पे गड़बड़ भी होता है मैं ना बोल चुका हूं आपको कि आपने अपने दिमाग में ये सब बातें आने दी वो मेरे लिए बहुत ही अफसोस इट इज अनफॉर्चुनेट दैट यू अलाउड सच थॉट्स टू गेट इनटू योर हेड इट इज रियली तो मैं बता रहा हूं तो मैं बता रहा हूं सर तो जब मैं फोकस ही नहीं कर पाऊंगा कि क्या सही बोल रहा है कौन सही बोल रहा है क्या गलत बोल रहा है तो फिर मैं सुन ही नहीं पा रहा हूं उसको तो सिर्फ कान में लगा करके सर मैं और इरिटेट हो रहा हूं ना or irritate ho yeah, yeah 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 i know that irritation that is the yeah. negativity that has kaam, yeah, to main kaam How can someone be ne you know irritated in a class because of listening to others that can only happen when you have allowed yourself to feel so negative but again paisan it's unfortunate because i know you are a nice person but sometimes we allow ourselves to do something or feel something that is not yeah, actually, good for main... us सर देखिए एक्चुअली में मैंने आपको जब बोला था सर कि मैं उसको ज्वाइन करना चाहता हूं क्लास को उसी टाइम पे मैंने आपको बोला था सर कि बट मेरे पास टाइम नहीं है शुरू में ही मैंने बोला था लेकिन आपने मुझे Again, बोला था कि am, आप ज्वाइन totally okay totally तो okay फिर मैंने वहां पे फोर्सफुली बस आपके वजह से ज्वाइन किया था सर ठीक है Again, जब I'm, मैं उसको ज्वाइन कर भी लिया जी सुनिए सर आप मेरे what I'm thinking about you right now, because everything you're saying makes me feel, listen, Faizan, did I ever tell you that you have to be most regular there? Did I tell you that? If you have a job and the job is important for you, then you could miss a few classes there, right? When you were actually, I classes. want to join this class, sir. But uh, daily, daily, वही चीज हो रहा था ना सर. किताब का एक लाइन भी आगे नहीं बढ़ रहा है और सिर्फ बकवास किए जा रहे हैं वो लोग. तो मेरे को सर ईयरफोन लगा करके सिर्फ उनका बात सुनना मेरे को पसंद नहीं आया सर क्योंकि मेरा काम भी है ना उधर. तो बेहतर है कि मैं एक चीज करूं अच्छे से करूं. Still, still, you are ex not accepting that you have allowed yourself no, to sir, be so negative. No, sir. I didn't. Okay. I didn't Fine. accept. I rest my case, sir. I rest my case with you because you are saying. I, I, it, I know, sir. I, I know, sir. You talk uh, about me at evening class. 
but uh, when you talk to uh, about me then uh, please invite to me this group because i want to say something about myself i don't want okay. to say anything uh, when you find me when you find me talking about you in the recording please talk to me about it okay because all i can say is i like my students to take the challenge afreen and shazia these students both these students have very poor english okay um they didn't want to be sir, in this class ko main eh, genuinely ek cheez bata de raha hu sir aap mano chahe nahi mano mere bahut sare student matlab uh, hai aise uh, evening class mein jo is tarah se sir irritate ho rahe hain aur wo bolte bhi hain ke time waste hota hai evening class mein koi aapko bol rahe nahi raha hai main thoda alag type ka person hu main kisi ko matlab kya usko aapko bahut pehle bhi bola tha ki main koi bhi insaan hu matlab main थोड़ा सोशल नहीं हूँ सर मैं मुंह पे बोल देता हूँ बुरा लगे तो लगे तो इवनिंग वाले क्लास में ना सर बहुत से बंदे ऐसे हैं ना जो अपना काम छोड़ करके आते हैं पढ़ाई करने के लिए और कभी कभी क्या होता है कि बहुत ज्यादा फालतू बात होता है इधर उधर का तो उसमें मतलब पता नहीं सबका अपना अपना ये है लेकिन ऐसा है सर इट इज वेरी नेचुरल और कोई आपको बोलेगा नहीं ये भी आप जान जाइए मैंने मैंने आपको आपको बोल बोल दिया मैंने आपको बोल get दिया बट कोई नहीं बोलेगा आपको इंटरमीडिएट क्लास have all come from the elementary course right in the elementary course they felt some improvement in themselves that's why they're there in the pre intermediate class now the thing is it is true that in the pre intermediate class sometimes there are discussions which are not related to what we are studying those could be related to social issues political issues sometimes very controversial issues no sir he talked about her self now, faizan, you have self. spoken faizan let me speak faizan let me speak i'm talking to the students and to you you have to listen to me as well it's not about you faizan okay it's about students it's not about you so students talk there of course they do but it is also true that some students who want to speak can't fight with those who are speaking there are students who desire to speak like sara like tafik they don't speak much there are a couple of more students who don't speak much not because they can't speak it is not their personality you know they everybody has a personality they're quiet type of people i have to encourage them to speak introverted or extroverted you know okay those who like limelight when there are 10 people they'll speak and there are those when they see 10 people they won't speak and there are those who want to speak then find it difficult okay so the students who don't speak don't want to speak they can but they don't they can't come they don't care but otherwise when you're trying for something and you're not getting the opportunity because other people are you know dominating the scene it is natural to feel a little bad you know and on the top of that if you have an argument with one of those students or some of those students there was another class faizan and instead of shahid afridi there was a boy called what is what was his name who was from munger rizvi he created the same situation okay nobody liked him just like shahid afridi gets on people's nerves you know with his with his conversation uh, the same thing happened with rizvi and guess what even i got annoyed with him many times uh what can i say um just that there are times when you need to have patience it's very easy to become judgmental to become cynical but you should not forget that the judgment that i make there are times when i decide to put my foot strongly you know that no this is how it should be no this is not allowed but if i am letting something happen 
and you, anybody, either Faizan or anybody, suppose in the class we are talking about something, okay, and a student is not happy with that. It is his personal freedom to disagree with what is going on. There is nothing wrong with that. But as a teacher, I feel that I keep an eye and I agree what he's saying. I felt that he's not wrong. There were conversations and some people were dominating the scene. And I was thinking about it. It's not that I am totally unaware of what's going on. And I knew I had to do something and I did it. I did it. But some people didn't have enough patience. They started to feel more negative too early. And when two or three such students start talking to each other, the situation becomes worse. The situation becomes more bad. When two or three such students start talking to each other, they say, what's going on today in class? Yes, man, Khali, Khali, they say something like that. So when two, three people meet, you know, come together of the same opinion, then they become valid. They start to validate each other and they become more sure of their opinion that what they're thinking is right. On one hand, Faizan said, if you talk about me, invite me because he wants to be there to defend. On the other hand, he did not follow the same standard when he talked about the class with two or three students who agreed with him, he did not decide to have the teacher there to defend that argument. Sir, actually, they don't uh, uh, tell me, uh, uh, tell to me in personal. Uh, only uh, uh, when uh, in breakout room, sometimes, yeah, we don't have time. Uh, but uh, sometimes uh, like i said Paisa, uh, like i said like i said follow the same sure. standards as you said when you talk about me sir please invite me there i want to be there to defend myself to tell but you but sir our i told you na i don't have uh, uh, much time and uh, i listen Paisa, to uh, you I, only you can be i smart. don't you are smart but sir, again, main bol i have just, just... to sun sakta hu na sir lekin you should have had more patience. You should have complained to me rather than talk to your friends. You should have complained to me. I didn't do anything. I बस मैं अपने हिसाब से आपको बता रहा हूं कि और सभी फील करते हैं लेकिन कोई बोलते नहीं है मैं तो आपको बोल ही रहा हूं कोई बोला नहीं है मेरे को कोई स्टूडेंट नहीं बोला है किसी ने कुछ नहीं डिस्कस किया है मेरे को इस मैटर पे लेकर के लेकिन मैं बता रहा हूं आपको कि सारे फील करते हैं कोई बोल नहीं रहे लेकिन मैं वैसा नहीं सर जो फील होता है मैं बोलता हूं यू आर अ स्मार्ट पर्सन हाउ इलॉजिकल यू साउंड व्हेन यू से दिस that nobody has said anything to me, but I feel what they know. So now you are becoming Ansari Army. Okay, Ami, okay sir. Uh, let's uh, uh, let's no. check your student no. mind. Okay. Aaj saam mein jaiye aur aap na aisa pretend kijega ki jo main bola hu na aisa pretend kijega ki aap isse agree karte hain. Dekhega saare bande agree nahi karenge. Fir aap mujhe bataiye. I know. I have already said that. I said that I felt the same way. Then why do I have to disagree with you? What I'm saying is... Rahe, sir, ki aap aisa bol rahe Bina kisi you kuch are the one who decided... You are... Okay, let me tell you, Faizan, very clearly. If you had kept saying only one thing, that I left the class only because I was busy. Only because I was busy. No other reason at all. No, sir. No, okay. no, no. I, I, I have lots of reasons. I have lots yes. of reasons. Only busy, nahi, sir. Busy, to main subah mein bhi hu. Dekhi, abhi main sarat pe ja raha hu. Kuch Aizan, kaam se. All I will say to you. Liye. All I will say to you. All I will say to you is, try to be less judgmental sometimes. It's not fair. I like you, but this judgmental character character that you're showing sometimes. You know, I know you don't like Harsh Aida Freebi. That's okay. You don't have to like everybody. That guy can be a little irritating at times. He talks too much about himself and about his girlfriend. <laughs> he talks but about sir, you his... take 
सर यहाँ पे प्रॉब्लम ये होता है कि आप तो उसको मजाक में ले लेते हो क्योंकि आपको तो कोई इफेक्ट होता नहीं आप तो सर हो ना लेकिन जो दूसरे बंदे रहते हैं उसको वो डोमिनेट करता है तो उनको तो खराब लगेगा ना उसका मतलब वो हंस के नहीं ले सकते ना आपको तो पता है कि वो अगर आप करेगा भी कुछ भी बोलेगा आपको तो आप हंस लोगे तो थोड़ा सा ये सब में कंट्रोल रहता है तो ठीक रहता है और इससे कोई दिक्कत नहीं है सर वो तो बहुत पहले का बात था बट मतलब कंटिन्यूसली वो सिर्फ अपने बारे में बोलता रहता है ना कुछ टॉपिक के बारे में बोले कुछ एग्रीमेंट हो तो वो एक अलग बात होता है सिर्फ अपने बारे में बोलना यू आर बीइंग ओवर जजमेंटल दैट्स ऑल ओके व्हाट एवर हैज हैपेंड व्हाट एवर थिंग्स हैपेंड वी हैव द रिकॉर्डिंग ऑफ ईच क्लास ऑन YouTube ओके वी हैव द रिकॉर्डिंग ऑफ ईच क्लास ऑन YouTube एवरी क्लास वाज रिकॉर्डेड एंड इट वाज पुट ऑन YouTube ओके तो so सर बट मैं यही बोलूंगा शाम वाले क्लास में टाइम नहीं रहता है ना और मैं फोकस करना चाहता हूँ एग्जैक्टली जैसे अभी आप सुबह में इस क्लास के बारे में भी बोल लेना तो मैं मतलब ऐसा नहीं चाहता सर मैं ना इस क्लास को भी छोड़ दूंगा अगर मेरे साथ नहीं हो पाएगा तो मैं इस क्लास को भी छोड़ दूंगा सर क्योंकि मुझे नहीं पसंद की मैं सुनू मैं चाहता हूँ मैं खुद से करूँ यू आर बिकमिंग बेटर फैजान यू आर बिकमिंग बेटर ओके यू आर बिकमिंग बेटर All your lovely words and everything. मैं सब किसी के भी मीठे शब्दों को तब टेस्ट करता हूं जब वहां पर एक्शन की बात आती है जब मेरे रहने के बावजूद भी आपको लग रहा है कुछ गलत हो रहा है लेकिन आपको बार बार आप कहते हो कि आप मुझ पर यकीन करते हो तो शो करो उस समय मोमेंट में कि आप मुझ पर यकीन करते हो लेकिन आप मेरे ऊपर चढ़ के डिसीजन लेते हो और उसके बाद आप कहते हो यू ट्रस्ट मी देन आई एम नॉट ए चाइल्ड आई विल बिलीव योर वर्ड आई बिलीव योर एक्शन I believe your actions, Faizan. If you are feeling annoyed right now and you are saying that I will leave this class as well, it will be entirely your decision. But again, I remember all the good things you said as well. It is time to walk those words, walk the talk. I kept saying, kept saying, kept saying. Faizan, that class challenging is. Class, that challenging is. Bane raho usme, faida hoga. Tough time, discomfort situation, out of comfort zone, ja ke faida hota hai. I agree. I'm not a. I'm. I didn't become a teacher yesterday. Sometimes certain people have that personality. Faizan and Shahid Afridi had issues with each other, but that sir, issue should not. Sir, it's not matter, be. sir. Uh, at that time, uh, sir, I. It has mattered so much to you, Faizan. It has mattered so much to you. Except that. Sir, what are you saying? Both matter. Are you un? It mattered so much to you. It mattered so much to you. मेरे पास बहुत सारे रीजन है मैं उस टाइम पे ऑफिस में काम भी करता हूँ कभी कभी ऑफिस से निकल जाता हूँ तो रोड पे रहता हूँ फिर शाहिद अफरीदी का भी रहता है उसका टाइप का फिर एक और लड़का है वो भी रहता है तो मतलब समझ ही में नहीं आता है कि एक तो किताब खोल के बैठा हुआ नहीं हूँ आप भी कुछ बोल रहे हो वो भी नहीं समझ में आ रहा है वो लोग भी कुछ बोल रहे हैं वो भी नहीं समझ में आ रहा है ना कन्वर्सेशन में पार्ट्स ले पा रहा हूँ जस्ट ओनली से वन थिंग आई होप समू रियलाइज दैट यू आर बींग लिटिल सिनिकल अ लिटिल जजमेंटल टू जजमेंटल दैट डजेंट चेंज एनी थिंग guys i'm um, sorry i took your time um this discussion could have taken place outside the class as well but remember faizan i have already told you that sing uh, stop small mistakes and you said that i will criticize your small mistakes because you left the evening class no leaving the class for the right reason you know there is a boy in my class i will tell you faizan and everybody here there is a student in my class evening class 4 o'clock class he joined my class 4 years after taking the break he was here in 2019 all right and he said sir i'm sorry i can't continue my class can i leave i will come back later i said okay life you know your priorities i respect that he came to this class in now 4 years later and i allowed him because he had asked me for my permission so if a student decides to leave the class because of personal reasons i respect that because in life learning english is not the most important thing there are other things which are more important sometimes yes or no life you know you have priorities so when you realize that english is not fitting in your priorities list 
then leave. I always say this to people, okay? Suppose, I don't know if any institute, any teacher has this kind of provision in their course, in their institute, that if you realize in the middle of the course that it is not the best time for you to do the course because you're not able to do full justice, I encourage them to take a break, okay? Because I want people to put this on the priority list when they're doing the course. So four years later, that boy has come and I'm teaching him, okay? So Faizan's statement that he left the class, that's why I will criticize him. How fair is that, Faizan, that you made that comment about me, that I will criticize your mistakes because you left the class? Yes, sir, it's was my that, mistake. Was that not, was that not a mean, mean statement? Yes, sir. I will criticize you because I want you to put English on your priority list. There is this guy Ravi in your class. I always criticize him. Why? Because he wants it easy. He wants it easy. Guys, sometimes things are more challenging. You have to take the challenge. You have to take the challenge. You can't always study ABCD because ABCD is simple. You have to start reading sentences, right? So when challenging things are there, it will be difficult. You have to try hard. And on the top of that, that, that students, classmates, you, are, you guys are lucky that you have lovely classmates. Nobody makes you irritated. But sometimes it can happen. No more. Yes. It's a very difficult task to manage all these things. And the students have their own judgment. They won't understand my situation. It's very difficult. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand. You had just an easy job. No tension. I know. Fine. All I will say is, sabko apna opinion rakhne ka dikar hai, no doubt. Okay. But that opinion doesn't have to be right. It doesn't have to be the truth. Okay. Uh, coming back to what we were doing. Uh, a passion for success. We talked about, do you have any talented people in your family? What can they do? You guys shared a little bit. Um, now, exercise two, look at the pictures of Nicola Bendetti and her father, Gio. Nicola Bendetti and her father, Gio. Look at the pictures of Nicola Bendetti and her father, Gio. Lovely people, good looking people. Just a second view okay you can see the pictures here i can turn on the big screen for you one of the worst uh, dis disagreement happens when a student starts to feel ignored in the that's one of the worst situations or when a student starts to feel that somebody else gets more attention. Okay, this girl is Nicola Bendetti. And this man, old man is, uh, who is Gio? Nicolas? Nicholas. Nicholas father. Right. And here you see another girl in this picture. Who is she? Mm -hmm. Who do you think? Nicola. Nicola's mother, but she looks very much the same age. <laughs> Take a look at this woman here. She looks more like Nicola's mother, right? Mother. She looks more like Nicola's mother. Do you think she could be her sister, maybe? Yeah. yeah. Okay, now please read this introduction here. Read the introduction and answer these five questions.
a passion for success. Nicola Benditti is a world famous violinist. She was the BBC Young Musician of the Year in 2004 when she was 16. She lives in Chiswick, West London, near her sister, Stephanie, who is also a violinist. Their father, Gio Bendetti, is a businessman. He lives with his wife, Francesca, in Scotland. Now, what does Nicola do? Everybody, please answer. Don't keep quiet. I've told you, keeping quiet is not an answer, not a response. She plays the violin. She is a violinist. She plays the violin. Okay. And she's a world famous violinist. There are millions of violinists in this world. But this woman is not just another violinist. She's not just another violinist. She's a special one. She is a world famous violinist. Why was 2004 special for her? Uh, because she became the. She was the BBC uh, young musician. The young musician for the year. In 2004, she was the BBC mm. young mm. musician mm. of the year. Of the year. Right. Why was 2004 special for her? Because she won, she won, she won the B young, BBC Young Musician Award, okay? Yes, in 2004. That's why 2004 was special for her. Where does she live? She lives in Chesapeake, West London. West London. And uh, what does her sister do? She is also a violinist. Her sister is also a violinist. violinist. Her sister is a violinist too. Okay. And what does her father do? Her father is a businessman. He is a businessman. He's a businessman. Very good. Now, we are going to divide ourselves in two groups, okay? One group will read about Nicola and the other group will read about Gio. So, who do you want to read about? Who are you more interested in, Nicola or Gio? Gio. Who are you more interested? You're more interested in Nicola or more interested in Gio? Choose your character, choose your okay. person. Gio. If you are interested in Nicola, then read about Nicola Bendetti, the text on the right side page. And if you are interested in Gio, read about Gio Bendetti text. So choose your person and read. Choose one person, whoever you want to choose. Where are you, Shadab? Holly, sir. Where are you? College. College at this time? Yes, sir. Where? <laughs> Where? Nine college, sir. In class. Wow. Morning, classes are morning in college, in winter season. And you have to attend classes. Otherwise, you won't be able to take exam. Okay. They will cancel your admission. Wow. Attendance is necessary. Okay. Good. This way, you know, you can enter in, you can, um, what is that? Advertise my classes in your college <laughs> when you're not studying from home.
So you guys can see exercise three. There are two sets of questions, two groups of questions. Can you see? First eight questions and then second eight questions. So those people who are reading about Nicola, they will answer the first eight questions. And those who are reading about Geo, they will answer the second eight questions. Actually, now that you are doing it at home and it is a Sunday, look how difficult it gets. I was not supposed to teach this today. Today, I was supposed to practice, give you practice for that practice book exercise, you know. Uh, but unfortunately, because you guys had not done your homework, I was forced to teach this. Now, you've got extra homework, guys. Those who did not do the practice book exercises, they have to do that practice book exercise about Pete and Olivia. When I was a child, page number 30, that is already your homework. And now you have more homework. You guys are going to read about Nicola and Gio and answer these questions in exercise three. This is also your homework. You see, when something is happening in the class, you know, anything that is not very okay. For example, we are studying great. But sometimes Faisan's observation that the class was getting derailed, we were having different discussions. I was observing that and I was not happy with that, honestly. Because I understand when a debate is healthy and when a debate is not, un when a debate is unnecessary. I understand that. But sometimes certain flaws I give you so much freedom here with them, my online class. You know, in all, all the online classes, the control of my is in the teacher's hand, right? The teacher decides who speaks, who doesn't. I don't like that. I prefer my students to have the control as long as it is okay. Honestly speaking, I was considering to keep the control of my in my hand in that class because the students were you know, not one or two students, I won't say that. It was just that it became, and it happens because everybody can speak some English. You see, when you can speak English, then it's difficult to control yourself when you have an opinion. You want to speak, you know? And we touched some controversial topics there as well on some days. You know, when you have a discussion class, when you have a discussion, you touch a topic, anything can happen. So it is natural that some people feel a little bit left out. Left out is a good phrase here. Left out. You feel left out. Okay, so some students feel left out. It is natural. And I am aware of it. It's not that I'm totally unaware. But I have a personality. I don't really shout at people like this. Bhai, aise tum nahi karoge. Aise, you know, controlling type personality. डोमिनेट कर आप उनको प्यार समझाते हैं बाद में कि देखो ये ऐसे सही नहीं है और वो हो जाता है I do not disagree with the what Faizan said that, ha, huh, yes, sometimes it's not only in his class. Whenever we are in the pre-intermediate class, intermediate class, we end up in discussions, a lot of discussions. In the elementary class, usually the teacher speaks, the students listen. But because in the elementary, they learn to speak when they are in the higher level classes, they don't only listen, they talk, they speak. And it can sometimes get out of hand the situation but it was not that bad as he made it he, you know he felt in his mind all i am saying again and again is paisar should have not thought so negatively about it agar aapke ghar mein papa roz aapke liye acha khana leke aa rahe char din acha khana nahi aaya aap us char din mein pura chilchilane lag gaye to phir mamla kharab hai sir aapko panchve din ka wait karna chahiye ki papa acha khana la sakte hain fir se theek hai yahi hai आपस का प्यार और आपस का रिश्ता आप उस चार दिनों में परेशान हो गए 
एकदम डिसाइड कर लिए कि हम हमको दूसरा पापा चाहिए तो फिर गलत है बात कर ठीक है तो बस यही मेरी सलाह होगी सारे लोगों को कि जब भी सिचुएशन ऊपर नीचे हो तो अगर आप वैल्यू करते हैं किसी चीज को तो ओपन कॉन्वर्सेशन करिए खुल के करिए और समझने की कोशिश करिए और जाहिर सी बात है जब लोग बराबर उम्र के होते हैं तो उनके बीच का कंपटीशन बहुत ज्यादा होता है तगड़ा होता है एक बात बड़ी फैजान ने सही कही कि आपके लिए आसान है हंस देना उसकी बात पे हम लोग के लिए नहीं जब आप बराबर उम्र के होते हैं तो आप झगड़ा ज्यादा करते हैं प्यार भी ज्यादा करते हैं एक दूसरे से जब दोस्ती होती तो तगड़ी होती है और झगड़ा होता है तो तगड़ा होता है क्योंकि बराबर उम्र के हैं एक दूसरे के साथ वो पियर प्रेशर में समझते हैं पियर ग्रुप का रिलेशन कैसे चलता है बट uh, मैंने अब तक तो यही किया है अगर आपको अब तक सही लगा और दो चार जगहों पे कहीं पे किस, किसी के साथ थोड़ी आपकी मतभेद हो गई अचानक से तो फिर मैं यही कह सकता हूँ कि आप सब लोग आजाद है जैसे चाहे सोचे लेकिन मैं अगर आपकी जगह होऊंगा तो मैं चाहूंगा कि मैं थोड़ा पेशेंस ज्यादा रखू ठीक है और एक जब डिसीजन लेने की बात आती है तो मैं उसको रिग्रेट नहीं करना चाहता मैंने लाइफ में से हर बड़ी में कई डिसीजन लिए हैं आई रिग्रेटेड दम तो एक बात ध्यान रखना कि मैं वापस आता हूँ शाजिया और आफरीन के बारे में कि शाजिया और आफरीन जब इस क्लास को ज्वाइन किए थे तो इनको समझ नहीं आती थी मेरी बातें तो मैंने हेल्प करने के लिए कुछ दिनों के लिए एक हिंदी मीडियम क्लास शुरू किया दोपहर में और मैंने उसमें कई लड़के लड़कियों को हेल्प किया जिनकी इंग्लिश काफी कमजोर थी उसमें उनकी हेल्प करी उसका नतीजा ये निकला और शाजी और आफरीन बार बार मुझसे कहते थे कि हम दोपहर वाले क्लास में रहें सिर्फ इसको छोड़ दें सुबह वाले क्लास को ठीक है क्योंकि उसमें मैं हिंदी में बात करता था वो समझती थी यहाँ आई टॉक इन इंग्लिश तो इट वॉज डिफिकल्ट फॉर देम तो दे आस्किंग इस क्लास को छोड़ दे इस क्लास को छोड़ दे तो मैंने हमेशा कहा नहीं शाजिया नहीं आफरीन नहीं बने रहो मुश्किल होती मुझे पता है रास्ता कैसे जाता है तुम बने रहो ना जस्ट स्टे इन द क्लास फिर आई स्टार्टेड माई इवनिंग क्लास दे आई बिकॉज दैट वॉज फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग आई आस शाजिया टू ज्वाइन दैट क्लास तो इन्होंने पूछा कि वो क्लास अकेले करी है इसको छोड़ दे मैंने कहा नहीं छोड़ना नहीं चाहिए तुम दोनों करो तो ज्यादा अच्छा है मैं बार बार इन दोनों कहता हूँ कि दोनों क्लासेस करो क्यों क्योंकि सीधी सी बात है तुम लोग की इंग्लिश अच्छी क्यों नहीं है बात गौर से समझो क्योंकि तुम्हारे सामने इंग्लिश नहीं रही बच्चों एक इंग्लिश मीडियम में पढ़ने वाले बच्चों को खूब इंग्लिश का मौका मिलता है यहाँ बिहार शरीफ वाले इंग्लिश मीडियम नहीं जो अच्छे इंग्लिश मीडियम होते हैं उनको खूब सुनने का मौका मिलता है इंग्लिश सिंपल सिंपल इंग्लिश बचपन में और उसकी वजह से उनके दिमाग में बदलाव आ जाता है इंग्लिश को लेकर जब से आप बंगाल में रहोगे तो बंगाली सुनते सुनते आप बंगाली सीख जाते तो खूब मैंने इंकरेज किया इनको यहाँ रहने के तो मैंने हमेशा कहा है कि जहाँ मुश्किल लगे वहां रहना है थोड़ा मेरे जहां मैं कह रहा हूँ यानी कोई भी मुश्किल जगह पे मैं कह रहा हूँ रहो यानी मेरा जजमेंट है मैं कह रहा हूँ इससे फायदा हो सकता है तुम्हारा उस पर तुम अपना ओवर करोगे जजमेंट को अगर शाजिया और आफरी मेरी बात ना माने तो मैं बस यही कहूंगा कि ठीक है वो बच्चियां हैं समझदार लोगों से उम्मीद ज्यादा होती है भाई आप तो मेरी बात ज्यादा मानो क्योंकि आप समझदार हो आपको तो ट्रस्ट करना चाहिए ठीक जो जैसे अगर मैं कोई बड़ी बात कर रहा हूं तो मैं बच्चों को उम्मीद करता हूँ नहीं समझेंगे वो कोई बात नहीं लेकिन समझदार लोग तो समझे कि मैं क्या कर रहा हूँ तो पेशेंस थोड़ा रखें पॉजिटिव रहें दैट्स ऑल माय सजेशन टू एवरीबॉडीज एंड कीप लर्निंग गाइस आई सी यू गाइस ऑन मंडे बट यू हैव अ लॉट ऑफ होमवर्क यस अटेंडेंस प्रैक्टिस बुक होमवर्क एंड एंड यू नो नाउ मेन बुक होमवर्क प्रैक्टिस बुक होमवर्क आई होप यू हैव ऑलरेडी डन अगर नहीं करा है तो देखो यही नुकसान होगा आपका अपने काम को ये करोगे तो आपको एक्स्ट्रा पड़ जाएगा क्योंकि क्लास तो रुकना नहीं है ना क्लास तो आगे चलना है सो पदमा योर प्रेजेंट शाजिया प्रेजेंट रुखसार प्रेजेंट अरसलान एबसेंट अथर एबसेंट आतिफ इज एबसेंट टू सफदर इज एबसेंट फैजान अहमद एबसेंट साहिल बिहारी एबसेंट फैजान अली प्रेजेंट खुशबू प्रेजेंट नसीन एबसेंट शारिक अहमद एबसेंट अभिनव एबसेंट Mudassar absent, Ganpat Roy absent, Tasif absent, all of them are absent today. And Faiz is absent, Rishikesh is absent, and Sunu Nigam is absent, Sain is absent, Mehran is present, Musharraf Imam, Musharraf, Musharraf. No Musharraf, sir. Are you here? No. 
Okay, Ranjit is present, Shadab is present, Simran is present, Zeba is present, Rashin is absent, Sriti absent, Adzu is present, and Faraz absent, and Lalla absent, Moon absent, Mudassar Alam absent, Mawsam absent. Okay, so that's all for today, everybody. We will meet on Monday. Please don't forget to do your homework, okay? It's too much homework, but you have to do it. Bye-bye, take care. Bye, bye, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, bye, bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.